So it's a beautiful morning, so I packed up my lunch, I packed a bag, I got the dogs, and I stormed over here to have a picnic in the sunshine whilst looking at the rock pools, and I got here, and now I think it's about to rain. But, still got some awesome rock pools. Um, and I want to show you something which we have lots of. So these are something which I'm sure anyone who loves rock pools will recognise. These are beetle anemones, and they're the most common type of anemones. You usually see them kind of up on the rocks, like this, and they look like little little dry jelly tots. They're usually a little bit more colourful than this, but the sun's gone in, so they're not quite as red as they usually are. And they're not called beetle anemones because that's what they look like when they're out. They're called beetle anemones because of these little spots around here. And that's part of its um, venomous mechanism for getting hold of prey. So this rock pool here, though it looks it looks fairly unassuming, it's full of ferocious predators, which is quite exciting. But you see, if we touch them, our fingers are toothed. Wow, look at that guy. He went right for it. I think I missed it with the camera. Let me try this one. By the way, don't do this too much because it uses up their energy. But look, holding on to that. Now imagine I was a little snail or something. But um, these, uh, we can't feel it because our fingers and our, our hands and our skin's too thick. The one place we can feel it, however, is on our tongue. And uh, I have it on very good uh, authority from a very wise marine biologist that uh, if you lick them, you can feel the sting on your tongue. And uh, I must say that I have done that. And it's true, it's a little bit like chili. So licking anemones are uh, maybe not that recommended, but still quite interesting. But anyway, so they're really cool little things. I know they're very common, but I st still think that they're still so gorgeous to watch, especially when they come out, see? And what's really cool about them is that they, um, they reproduce a full young. So I've never seen it, but it would be really cool to catch them. I think you've got to be really super lucky. But right from the middle, they, um, they, just, they just birth an entire fully formed, Something to something to see.